size up and make second sandals. Right. Um, I'm going to say they probably, we will do some try-ons for mm. you once we get well into the season. Um, I'm going to say if you are normally a 38, the 38 is going to be fine. Mm. If, not, if anything, it's going to be a bit roomier. Yeah. Um, just because of the, the the width and the depth on this last. Yeah. Um, so that's good. I don't know if we've had any, more, any feedback about this last year because it's just so, so fresh. I, mean, it's, we're, I think fresh we're the boat. sending out our first pair to our customer. An end that, customer. Yeah. yeah. So Today. our retailers, yeah, our retailers. Retailers have gone cray cray for it mm -hmm. and done lots of lovely social posts on it. Yeah. Uh, how are we going? We're going to keep going. Yeah, Let's just keep going. Mossy Garden said, oh, I spied yeah. some metallic boots online at a retailer. Are yes. there more metallic styles coming? There are so <laughs> many things uh, just do a little... to go through. Yes. There are so many things to go Golden through. This. <laughs> uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go like box by box around me uh, and you can see these for the first time like myself. Um, so I'm going to show you here uh, really popular style bike marks. So we this is a repeat style. In fact, um, Renee's wearing her white pair at the moment. Um, really comfortable little loafer. And loafers are huge again this winter. Uh, but I'm going to show you a pop of new color fashion trend. So this here is a dark, dark cafe chocolate brown. It's got an amazing feature crocodile embossed print over the leather. So you get all that textural difference. It actually, if you look closely, it's almost a checker emboss of dark light, dark light, cafe cocoa, uh, and then the kind of the scratch marks of a worn in crocodile, pretty much. Um, so it's really, really, really beautiful having that textural difference uh, rather than it just being just a one plain subtle color. Uh, so this year, our point of difference for this, if you had this loafer last year and you're looking for a reason to buy it again, um, we have, we've chosen to go with more of a matte black um, finish on the, uh, on the trim here, this little beautiful paper clip trim. So last year, the darker colours, we had uh, golds and silvers and things like that. So we're kind of settling it down a little bit for you. Uh, so again, you've got that, uh, I think this is a three centimetre heel in through the back, about a 1.2 centimetre platform in through the front. Nice lightweight, lots of grip in through the heel there, 100% leather, nice soft, soft leather as well. Uh, a little bit of um, your binding around there in the leather. So really, really beautiful. Uh, have we got any questions about these as I'm going along? Nope. Well, they're all very quiet. Everyone's just watching, watching it all. They're very, very yeah. quiet. Uh, so I'm going to pop this away um, and I'm going to go for... Have you, did you put these out for me, Danny? I have. Well, I thought that's a good segue from the heart, um, bite mark. Okay. Into, it's, uh. I actually put my size out, so we'll just move. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, actually, you'll want to we'll show, show the Show it anyway. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what Renee's going to be buying this season, ladies. Oh, you know. Oh, yes. So I can see is... this. Yeah, I can see this. <laughs> uh, so, uh, correct me if I'm wrong. This, this is half giant. bite. Mm -hmm. So, you just saw the full bite, <laughs> bite marks. The reason it's half bite is this because we've turned it into like a little slip-on mule, because we know that at this time of the year, uh, going into autumn, you don't want to be necessarily wearing a fully enclosed shoe. So this gives you kind of that ease of like moving into cooler months, uh, where your toes covered, uh, but your back's out, so you kind of can quickly slip in and race off in these. So you're looking here at the leopard, did we yep. call it white black leopard or just leopard? Uh, white, white black, black pony, pony, white black, mm. black pony, uh, and it's a leopard print on there. So the colours you're looking at, um, it's kind of like a winter white background with a shot of grey and black leopard spot print on that. So really pretty, and I've used a gun metallic um, paper clip tab trim in through the front there, just to tie back in with the um, grey tonings in the leopard. A nice black pigskin leather lining on that. Uh, it's elasticated in underneath here, so you get that grip over the arch there. Nice, easy, comfortable style to wear, ladies. They stay on the foot, which is really good. If I can Mel, see Mel Palmer. Nice She's like, oh, I like these. Oh, I, like I like these. I like it. Yes. Uh, I probably failed to uh, comment on the leather as well. So often women are quite shocked when we say it's pony leather. It's actually just a terminology reference to the fact that it's still actually cowhide, but it still has the hairs of the hide um, attached to the top surface of the leather. Uh, what that does is it creates a lot of interest and textual difference um, in the leather as opposed to a flat leather or an embossed leather. So it's not a pony. It's not my little pony. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, so, so there's another I'm going to tuck that away, away yeah. and let's have a look at what we've got, what Nay has put out for, oh yeah. 
So we're still on the half bite. Well, there's a few options. There's a few options. I actually just got bite. that one out for me. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I know. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, oh, what you're looking at here is the half bite and black croc. So this is what we call a giant uh, crocodile print on that. So you've got that lovely textural emboss on the black leather, slight shimmer to that leather, um, but not overly bright oh, no. and shiny. Yeah, it's like a sheen, isn't it? Yeah, I wonder if it would be quite good to hold your cocoa one on the, of the oh, yeah. white and the <coughs> black to show like the difference in the colour. Okay, good like, idea. Hold fire. Just to hold fire, everyone. Live action. Live action shot here. Oh, yeah. As I just, just put it away, trying to be a tiny idea of the detail. Okay, so I'm going to show you the difference here. Oh, yeah, nice. You're looking here frontwards at the cocoa. Um, cafe giant something or other checkered cafe check yeah leather uh, with all that detail there and then this is a slightly different um, crocodile emboss and through that background there more symmetry in it slightly more stylish I guess mm. is what I probably mm -hmm. comment on that it's quite um, nice for the ladies to see the difference in the, in the depth of color because we get a lot of questions mm -hmm. about you yeah. know like what sort of brown is it what kind of navy is it so yeah it gives a good so, yeah, so yeah. I think the black trim with the black sole and that cocoa ties back nicely. And you've got the dark gun trim metal mm. buckle on, uh, tab trim on the front of that, which is a, mm -hmm. by contrast a little bit different. Uh, okay, so that there is your. Oh, I might as well just, yeah, just leave them. I'm just there. making a mess for everybody. Tony uh, says, love these. Oh, yay! Exciting! Right, what have we got here? Denny. Denny. Ooh. Okay, this is, this is one of my favourites, ladies. Um, Called Danny after the dandy. So anyone that knows anything about dandies, dandies tend to be males that like to dress up in quite a dandy manner, like um, sort of more man-tailored, man-styled, sophisticated. Mm. So this is what I love about this. So uh, again, you can imagine this with like a little preppy pencil skirt for coming into um, to your uh, autumn winter. Again, a wide leg pant, the drama of that square, thick square toe on that is gonna be gorgeous popped with that patent leather. Um, yeah, it's it's uh, full skirts, full um, gourd skirts are gonna look really pretty with this kind of style. Mm. And I tell you who's gonna give you probably the best styling tips on this shoe is going to be repertoire clothing because they bought into the style quite heavily, which I'm so excited about because it was looking like at the start of our sale that we weren't gonna get it away. Uh, now let me tell you about the sole. It's very, very lightweight EVA. It's got grip on the bottom here. Um, and I'm looking at that, it looks like about a 1.8 centimetre height in through the back to two centimetres, and then maybe a centimetre in through here. Nice broad detail rand framing the outside of the sole. Uh, and you've got that squared off toe and that lovely little, I don't know if you can see the snub on the toe here, slight chisel uh, definition in through that. Very, very simplistically, sculpturally, architecturally kind of look to it, I guess. Um, so yeah, lovely. Double stitching rows around there just to highlight the actual cut of that upper. Are we liking, ladies? Have we got any yeah, comments about it? Yeah, we're liking. Um, Joy has um, asked us kindly to stop showing all of these because <laughs> she loves all of them so far. <laughs> and Tanya says, OMG, I love those too. Oh, well, I wonder, gonna... before you do that one, yeah. do you want to show the other? Like, Is there, where's the pink one? It's down, it's down and under here. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay. Really There's idea. one more exclusive colorway in this. Like mm. I said, some of our retailers didn't see the future of this kind of styling, and maybe it is a fraction early, um, but we do have another color in it, uh, and I'm gonna show you. I'm scared to put any of our beautiful shoes on our woodwork, um, because this is our, you can see all these wooden things behind me, and that's actually the start of our shop fit out. Um, that goes in. Yeah. Oh, come on, old lady. Judith oh, says love. Okay. Oh, it's oh, already open. Oh, oh, beautiful. Funny beautiful. that. I wonder if Renee okay. jammed her foot into a pair. Oh, <laughs> Renee. Renee. Okay, here we go. Second colorway in the style. Oh, oh, oh. Brace yourselves, ladies. Right, let's have a look. These are probably going to come home with me, I'd say. <laughs> so you better get them online. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they're online, I think. Are they? Yep. Oh, God. What? Candy, yeah, candy pink. pink. Candy pink. Sorry, my eyes are not working. Uh, so this is your beautiful candy pink color awareness. I'm just gonna check the box. Yeah, we did. So I don't know, I can't remember without the images when we did our shoot on this. Yeah, we give you two laces options for this. So you can really give it that very um, color blocked vibe in the candy pink and, and almost a slightly more pretty effect with its laces that it comes in. Um, but we have 
giving you inside the box a bonus pair of laces uh, in the black. If you put the black into it, it revolutionizes and changes the look quite dramatically. It kind of allows you possibly to wear it more back with your blocky black outfits. Um, and I don't know, kind of gives it a slightly more man-tailored vibe to it. So um, I think there are pictures online so you can see it styled with black laces. And then of course you can see it right here with its pink lace as well. So it's a really pretty color. It's not a, um, actually I'm gonna hold up to give some, Oh, where's our boot? Oh, oh, did I just did put it away? Did I put it away? No. I think you might have put it away. I'm, I'm trying to be tidy and it's really blowing up in my face a little bit. So I'm just going to show you the difference in colours here because I think Renee's onto something with comparisons of colours. Mm. It's kind of good to reference them really. So you can see there that this is your bubblegum pink, which is a lighter, softer, quite pretty girly pink. And then this, this candy pink is definitely a more defined, bolder, um, light pink. Mm. It's definitely no hot pink shades to it, but it's a, it is still a what I would call a light. It is true candy pink kind of, but but comparing the mm. two, you can see the two. The um, we've got a few. Um, uh, Michelle, I love the pink, but no thirty six. Oh, <gasps> sorry. Really? Have we got no thirty six oh. in in this? Mm. Did we not get a thirty six? Oh, we didn't. No, we didn't. Um, maybe maybe we could give you an insole for the thirty seven. Yep, yeah, and so we, we also it. haven't done like a proper fitting notes yet, so yeah, you know what I mean. So we haven't even right really had a good trial. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> um, right we have that. a Mary Whitsey stylist. Oh my god, loving these styles so fashion forward. Oh Mary, yay! Wow, um, that sounds good coming from a stylist, eh? Hey. Someone said off to get a big mortgage. What's up, Jane? Sorry. <laughs> Jane. And oh, hi, Caitlin. Caitlin's just oh, sending massive Caitlin. love hearts. Oh Elsie. my gosh, Caitlin. Elsie. I reached out to Caitlin and said, oh, I haven't heard from you. She sent me a message back and then I didn't reply. How rude am I? Uh, we miss you, Caitlin, and we often talk about you in the office. Mm. Yes, and we do. you need to come in and say hi. Uh, right. Oh, we've got. Oh, Tanya says, good idea with the laces. You have a doc. They have a Doc Martin vibe. And Susie oh, says love yeah. the pink. Um, oh, and now lovely Kirsten down at the um, HQ is oh, saying, Kirsten. thank you, ladies. Orders are coming in. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> so, um, so at the moment, we're still like, ah, because we're Kirsten's down at our old HQ, keeping the shop going, keeping the sale going on all the clothing and things. We're down here trying to get a new store established and stuff, so it's all a bit chaotic. Uh, we've got a new style here in Nika. That's going to be up like by the end of the day. Okay, so we it's can not do up that. yet. No, no, it's not up yet. Oh, that baby. Baby. It's ready to go. Oh, it's ready to go. Now. We're nearly there. The so we one can one show it. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, so this is our beautiful trusty baby and sneaker. Uh, we love this because it's got a lovely wedgie rubber outsole. So it's a really good wear it all day on concrete floor kind of shoe. Um, we've also upgraded it. We had a little issue last year with having red in through here and it um, spilling onto the outside. So we've changed that. So any ladies that had to return theirs, uh, we've got the new upgrade to it now. So we'll eliminate any issues like that. Uh, the other cool thing about this, which is very, very different is this. Let's have a look inside, girls. Look at that. Can you see that? Yeah, I'm gonna bring it to you so you don't fall over. Uh, what are we looking at? We are looking at a Sherpa style micro cozy little footbed in there. We've just got Russie arriving to pick up some more shoes. We're just doing a live, Russie. You come say hello to the ladies, tell them about Milford. No, no, no I'm not doing that, he says. I'm not doing that. Uh, so we've got the lovely Sherpa um, insole in there, which is just going to cozy you up for winter. Um, it's actually, I called it Bay Band, but it's a zip band. So just remembering that you ladies love this outside zipper, mm -hmm. so you don't have to participate in doing up shoelaces. Mm -hmm. What I also like about this as well, if you don't like having these big fiddly bows, you can tuck those inside the shoe and have that very minimal lace up look with the lacing tucked inside um, and you can just zip, zip in and out of it without having to alter it. And you will notice we've got extra branding on the front for you. So this is our little minx tab now, ladies. So it's got a beautiful silver minx tab in through there. If you don't like it, don't worry, you can unlace it and pull it out. Uh, it's not a... Um, yeah, it's not, it's not meant to put you off. Yeah, you can, it's not a game removable. changer. Removable. It's removable, thank yeah. you. Uh, so yeah, isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. And you will note too, if you're a lover of the Bandit sneaker, we've done exactly the same with the Bandit this Which winter. Which I believe is online it, it now. Is online and it is now. online. Yep. So the Bandit, in comparison, has got a slightly slimmer sole. Still that beautiful signature, soft rubber sole, uh, and that soft um, unlined leather upper, so it's nice and 
nice on the foot. Right, uh, do we want to keep going? Are the ladies interested? Yeah, we've got, we've got mm. 80, 80, 80 mm. between us. 80 between you, okay. Mm. Let's keep going for the ladies. What's in here, does anyone know? Um, um, Kendra. Kendra. Oh yeah. oh yeah, this is also going to be on at the end of the day. Okay, here we go, some box opening live action. Um, I Kendra, Kendra. Oh, I have to remember what these are, ladies. Right, let's show you Kendra and the White High Shine. Kendra White High Shine. Oh, yes. I don't remember all that. This is new. Yeah. <laughs> This is completely new, ladies. Never... Oh. We did not do this. Did we do this? No, we didn't. We How don't... did this happen? This is hilarious. This is hilarious. This is live this reaction. Is, this is actually everyone. creating. Yes, I love work. it. I do love we it. I love it. it. We love it. I'm very proud of I did not I sample it. this. I don't know no. how this has sneaked into our cartons. <laughs> This is live China, action. What is China doing to us? We're very grateful of our factories in China, but we've got a mystery show. <laughs> this is this is truly oh limited gosh. edition. Have we just got one carton of it? Is there a yeah. 36? <laughs> <laughs> there is a 36. This, this would look a amazing with your outfit today. It would look actually, amazing Can you try it? Oh, you probably can't try it. Well, it is a 37. I it is a 37. You should probably should put it on. Head. Look how messy. Look, I'm already dirty from hanging out oh, in this. No. I can't believe it. Could you put, should I put it on? on? I could put it on. Maybe no. put... You could put this is Kendra, ladies, and we do have this oh ready gosh. to get online. Just why Kush is doing a live yeah. trial. We won't, have, we won't be able to put this on. That one, probably, we don't have, look, you that one will be a bonus one, and if you're really good, you'll just have to. Um, oh lordy! Well, we've got oh, almost, we've got oh, almost lordy. ninety people. Oh on. lordy, girls, look at this! Well, oh my gosh, look how gorgeous she well, is. Well. I'm in love. Sorry about the floor and all that kind of thing. Look at that with the wide leg pad. Oh, and ladies, I can confirm I got to have a quick little try on of a sample that was in my size. And oh, you all healthy. know that my instep is quite tricky. This uh, Kendra is absolutely perfect on my high oh, enough yeah. instep. So it's because so. I've elasticated in here as well, yeah. so it lets it ease out for those higher insteps. But equally, if you've got a lower one, it should actually snap back and work so that it's holding you on your foot. Look at these gorgeous pyramids. This is what I loved about this style. We've got lots of colours in this style for you ladies. Oh my God, what a bonus. This what is great. And speaking of, Tanya said, do we have that in black as well, which we do. Yeah, we, we do. do. And honestly, once we finish this live, ladies, oh. I reckon set your timer for like an hour or maybe <laughs> less. Just for these ones. Oh that yeah, we're for the ones we show. Yeah, because they are ready to go. We just needed Is to do a live for bottle you. Bottle green in this as well. Did that? Come yeah, from? I don't think that came in this one. It's not in the shipment. Okay, we won't talk about that. Then. Yeah, the pastel uh, colour is. <laughs> the pastel colour is black and white. Claudia, bring me Claudia. What's Claudia? Claudia's a boot. New Claudia boot. Is a boot. Brand new boot. Brand okay. new sole. Oh, this is one that Repertoire's done as well, eh? Have they got this? Mm, not sure. Not sure. Black. Oh, well, there's a combination of things in here. There's a black new back and a tan. Oh yes, I know what's going on there, but that's okay. Oh, yeah. Oh yes, this. And the, again, this oh, shoe yeah. is ready to go. Oh, this is a brand new last and everything. So oh, much. This is we need to do this actual new last and things. We need to do a whole expose yeah. on because once we tell you about all of the amazing things to do with this shoe or boot, uh, you'll be in to try it. Um, particularly if we've got a lot of South Island ladies, this is like a boot that I designed for you. It's got that really cool edginess to it, but all the practicality of a good winter um, boot. Really, really cool. Uh, this is obviously, you just zip in and out of the front of it, so it's nice and easy to get in and out of. Um, and it's got a little rubbery platform in through here, nice stacked heel, um, lots of raw detail to it and things. And, Nice depth in through the last here, ladies. So you're getting lots of um, good fitting and things in through that in through that toe area. I feel like I need to. I need like yeah, a whole hour with to you do. to explain about the goodness of this boot. It's mm -hmm. so so good. Um, I should I show them? Because I do have the tan one here. It might be black. Is it? Oh no, it is tan. No, it is tan. I'm going to yeah. show you the tan while we've got it, just to give you a contrast in colourways. Mm -hmm. So that's that lovely, um, lovely sort of. Uh, oaky sort of tan shade in that nice raw edged leather again you've got that front zipper on it and that lovely sole it's the sole is like cushiony and soft and it's going to be delicious on your foot hmm. okay just because it was sitting there i thought i would show you right what else can we um we've got else? almost 100 ladies on can oh, we really? oh, it's building. i oh, mean it's part of me well, i 
Where this, are, well, this is going to blow people's minds, but is, is it too soon? Is it too soon? Is it too soon? Do you want to see a bit of winter boot colour, ladies? Anyone saying anything? I mean, are they all quiet? Well, no, everyone's loving it. Um, I mean, that one is going to be, people are going to go crazy for that. Okay, let's have a just... look. Let's have a look. Um, Cassidy. Oh, that's Kelly says the tan is beautiful. Karen says love these. <clears throat> oh, thanks. <laughs> We've got the builder in the background, ladies. Moving wood around as quietly <laughs> as he can. <laughs> oh, um, Kirsty Elliott saying loving all the newness. Deb says never too soon. Joy says stop teasing. <laughs> Um, which is that, was that Deb C that was on? Because that no, Deb C is not on. Oh, no, she's this not is on Deb Gray. Yeah. Okay, Deb Gray. <coughs> Linda says yes, winter boot colours. Yeah. And Yolanda <laughs> says got to have something to watch in the flooded waters. Oh, oh, oh Yolanda. Oh, please tell me your dry. Who? Emmy. Oh, Emmy. Says, Emmy says hi, girls. Hi, Emmy. Oh, hi. Yeah, Caitlin just said that through. Um, here we go. Oh god. Do you want to see it? Oh my god. This is going to create. Lots okay, okay. Of here we go. Have you got your sunglasses, ladies? Because, you know, it might not be sunny outside, but you're going to need your sunglasses for this pop of colour. Here we go. Here we go. Big reveal. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Yeah, I need this as well. Caitlin's going to lose her mind. Caitlin mm. is going to love these. So this is one of your favourite boots from last winter, the Piper boot. So this year, uh, we have put it into this Cerisi pink suede. Sorry, it's trying to come closer to you. And this beautiful Cerisi pink suede. Now, I know that some of you ladies freak out about suede. Well, particularly our retailers, do, retailers have a thing about not really enjoying suede. Just a reminder, it's already had one coating of a rain repel on it, but all you need to do is get a can of that rain guard and um, you know spray it uh, a couple of times a season and it should remain really beautiful and good. Uh, but look at that colour. Isn't it insane? Mm, uh, all I can say is... Everyone is loving it. We've oh, got hearts, we've got flames, we've got flames, <laughs> we've got eeks, we've got different love hearts. Oh, oh my god, I want them. Um, just ladies, these aren't online, yes, just to, just to confirm, reiterate, but we will work out our absolute hardest to, uh, get, to, to get them out. out. And we yeah. can tell you that we do have retailers with them now, and yes. some of them have actually listed them and do have them out for sale. So if you've got a favorite local retailer uh, that sells minks, they should really have got this you boot. could um because we don't have our online is listing up with our yeah. retailers listed if you did just google search piper hot pink suede mm -hmm. it should, should make if they have it online it already. should yeah. bring up who's yeah, got piper them hot pink yeah suede. Oh, love that, oh love it, love it, love it. Amazing. Um, I just, you know, it's a nice grippy sole. It's got that all that um, detailed stitching and round through the front here. You can zip in and out of it easily. It's got extra little fingerlings of stretch down and through here. If you do, if you're like me and have that slightly uh, more athletic leg, <laughs> don't know that it's athletic, but you know, it's going to give you all of that flexibility of fit in around that area there. Um, mm. Do I say if you don't like the hot pinkness of this, we've got a dirty rose? Yes, and I definitely know from Should sending we out the last week that most of the retailers who ordered dirty rose Piper has got them. So, oh, they've already. They're, yeah, okay. Do you want to see the dirty rose? Do you want to see what a dirty rose looks like, ladies? Oh, yes. Yeah. Hey, it's Valentine's. Of course you oh, do. <coughs> of course you do. Right. Let's pop her back in here. Tanya says, "Oh, gee, I could work there. I would be in shoe heaven." Oh. We are. We sometimes we feel like it's heaven. Sometimes yeah. we feel like it's hell. And We're so <laughs> disorganised at the moment, ladies. And Jenny said, "What was the name of the pink Chelsea that you showed at the start?" That was Elsie. Elsie, which is online. Which is online in limited sizes. Yeah, um, really, really yeah. limited sizes now. Our retailers have grabbed them. Our uh, we, we put it up live yesterday. We've sold a few online yesterday. Yeah. So. Yeah, honestly, it's not a sales pitch, grab them while you can. Um, and ladies, if your size is missing off our online website, definitely look at the retailers who have ordered them and ring them. It's all listed in the description box. I think there's about six people, but yeah, that's the quickest, fastest way to do it at the moment, to find a pair. Okay, this is what Dirty Rose is. <laughs> okay, let's have a look at here. So I think you're either that, look at that, it's almost like a peachy, mm -hmm. dusty sort of rose colour. Again, it's in suede, so you get that velvety richness of um, colour and effect. Sorry, here slightly. Oh, yeah. sorry. Yeah. Oh, because you're in the light there. Sorry, ladies. Nice. Um, yeah, so it's that really beautiful, beautiful, I'm just, oh, 
Oh, I put it away. The pink one, I keep doing that, eh? Mm. Um, yeah, so it's a really, really lovely, lovely colour. So if you like the khakis, you like brown tones, you like those sort of more autumn sort of shades and tones, and want to wear a pop of colour, this is actually a really nice way to do it. Mm -hmm. um, this is one of Kim's favourite colourways in this mm -hmm. boot, actually. A lot of retailers love it. Yeah. Them, yeah. yeah, so, so pretty. Almost a neutral, almost a neutral. Mm -hmm. uh, remembering it is suede, don't panic about the suede. Just get a can of that spray stuff. I think it's about $15 or maybe less, and just spray it on and away you go. Mm -hmm. uh, so that is the Piper in the uh, wow. Dirty Rose. Now, you had some stuff out there. Do we go I out did. there? Yeah, we can. Um, do you want to? There is a um, bite marks here that I got out for you in the two different options. Oh, okay. You want to show so, you know the bite marks loafers, ladies, that you love? Uh, we have got some, uh, this is a repeat yep. colourway. Yep. 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 So this is a repeat colourway. Renee actually has them on right now. So this is the uh, yes. white sky shine with that uh, beautiful golden trim on it. Mm. So that's your bite marks there in that colourway. And um, is this a new colour? Oh, and okay, this is a good white comparison. Mm -hmm. So when Annie came back from America, she went over to see her brother Ro. And uh, when Annie came over from back, she, she said, oh my God, white loafers are everywhere. So this here is your white on white loafer. This is perfect for this time of the year, actually, ladies. Um, so you've got that lovely crisp white sole. You've got a really soft, soft, buttery, milled leather upper on that in the white, paired back with that lovely silver trim on that. So really, really beautiful, um, simple kind of white. Loafer. Yeah. And you may have spotted that one in our video. Mm-hmm, exactly. Um, that oh. we did up at QT. Yes, yeah, yes. That this is the white loafer. The you OG. Finally here. Finally here. Yeah, we had lots of comments about it. When's it coming? Mm -hmm. When's it coming? So it is finally here, which is pretty exciting. <coughs> so those are some options. There are other options. Chili red in it. Uh, mallard in it. Yeah. We've got every camera going yep, from every sorry. angle. Right, so what's this here, Sydney? Mm -hmm. Are we not doing this one? No, maybe not. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. Maybe that one above. Oh, okay, yeah, the that clash. One, yeah. The clash? Okay. Because that one I can get We're going to leave something for tomorrow for the ladies. Exactly. Yeah. There's so much, ladies. It's so exciting. Um, how is everyone doing? Um, is everyone okay? Um, nothing to report about weather conditions for them or... Uh, right, I'm just filling in time while I pull out a 36 for you to have a look at. Uh, here we go. Right, so we've got this is Clash. Oh, yeah, this is a new colorway. Yeah. Okay, so this is your again one of your favorite styles from last winter. Um, the, uh, the style Clash. You loved this because of the sole. It has that kind of grungy, chunky sole, but then a slightly more refined kind of toe shape on it. Um, and it's really, really lightweight. So it looks like it's going to be really heavy on the foot, uh, but it's not nice and lightweight. Now, again, because it's a pop of bold colour, we've only done limited numbers in this throughout uh, all of our retailers. And the colour of this we have called tangerine. So it is a really, really nice winter tangerine colour, bordering on a, like a fire red. In fact, mm. it's one point where we're going to call it like a fire red. Um, but it is more orange tones. If you put it mm. with an orange, it's chili more red. orange. Mm. Yeah, chili reds. Mm. Yeah, so it's more orange than red and when we actually yeah. put the colours together. Uh, so if you loved the clash of last year, if you had a pair and you want to change your colours out, mm -hmm. and this is a great way to do it, uh, winter tangerine. It's not online yet, but it will be by the end, end of the day, day, the girls tell me. Bridget says, yes, love the orange. Yeah. Annette loves the white loafer, and Di wants to know if the white, the white loafer is okay on a high instep. <clears throat> uh, yeah, well, so Renee is wearing the bite marks, and Renee definitely has a higher instep, mm -hmm. um, and has struggled in the past with some of our styles. So, yeah, Renee, you can put your camera down onto oh, your yeah. own foot, like a bit of a selfie citro. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's very hard to get a flattering angle from here, but yeah, no, <laughs> it's totally fine on a high instep. Mm -hmm. I just slip them straight on. There's no, there's no issues with that at all. I yeah. and actually. I don't think I've had one customer come and buy this season's ones from that I'm wearing at the moment have an issue with um and with the instep. Mm. Yeah. Um a bit longer size isn't maybe needed to size up, which a few of our ladies know, so I'm wearing a forty two. Right. Um, uh, that's good intel. So the bite mm -hmm. marks that we've just been profiling, um Renee's gone up in those. So she's normally that forty one. She's chosen to get a forty two in that just to get a little bit of extra length. Annie, do you remember what size you were in the bite marks? 
a footy one. one. So, um, <laughs> hey, oh, are you off? Bye, are you off? Goodbye. You're looking cool, girl. Thanks. Nice and sailor, eh? <laughs> Stop it. Oh, we, we, do, we do oh. definitely want to give a shout out to Mischief and Milford. Oh. It's been tough over there. Yeah, yeah, the, all the retail stores are open, but very few people have gone in because of the uh, weather watches and weather warnings and things like that. Um, so yeah, he's just fill, filling in his time now. He's got staff there, but he's picking up a whole lot of this new stock actually. So if you've been watching and you're out Milford Way and you fancy a bit of time out, you can whistle in to um, to you race in there. Yeah, and he, you could race him there. He's got a bootload of um, bite mark stock and bits and pieces uh, and new things. I am just trying to find one second. Any, just, you might not know, Dutchie? Oh, have Dutchie. Dutchie there, yeah, you? we wanted to show you Dutchie. Only because it is online. It is it online is, and it's an excellent Or, or Donna. Dutchie, no, I think it's up to you. Oh, thanks, Okay. Um, <laughs> shall we? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry, Annie, I've got completely trashed your place here. Uh, what's around the corner here? Oh, 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 come over here, come over here. Um, this is something new for us ladies, but it's high time we bought it back. Uh, and we are so excited about this. Um, just because we feel at the moment you need a bit of colour and a bit of a point of difference and excitement um, to elevate your day. So, like I said, we would never normally do like a, a finer pointed court shoe, but we have had more kind of corporate ladies asking to bring back a bit more corporate styling, which this is what we feel is. Now, the great thing about this is the actual depth in the last. So, I've never been a fan of this kind of style because it's very narrow and your toes feel all bunched up, and by the end of the day, you're like, ah. Uh -uh. This has got lots of room in it. So you get all of this beautiful fit, um, but you get all room for your toes and feet. And I don't know why more people don't design it with more fit in the last. Uh, so you've got a lovely rubber. This is rubber in through here, so it's not that slippery, starchy feel. So look at all that flexibility in through the toe shape there. Uh, the heel height on this isn't extraordinary. You're six centimeters in height. Uh, if you look, if you're looking at me straight on, see this here, it goes, the weight of your body goes through this heel right, right down when your heel actually falls, uh, which means that, what well, that basically means is you get that nice stable feel when you're in this heel. So sometimes when you see um, a shape of shoe like this and the heel is perched off the back, it can actually feel quite unbalanced. The way this is situated, right bang, smang, bang, slap bang in the middle, <laughs> bang slang, <laughs> what am I trying to say, in the middle here, um, means that it's really, really nicely balanced for um, comfort and things. So look at the colour, that is electric green, that is going to look, oh, I could put that on, couldn't I? Oh, oh you could. God, I, I'm looking so dirty because of our um, flaws and that, poor Annie's trying to negotiate the... I wonder if it will fit with my little sockets, I could just, that's not going to fit with my socket, is it? Mm. No. Okay, so here is Style Andy. This is a size 37 that I've put on. Wow. Um, and look at that with my dusty pants. <laughs> Great pants. We did have a lady asking, sorry, um, mm. before about where you got, oh, Mel Palmer, I think, wondering where you got your pants. Oh. I was going to pop a little message to everybody asking you about Kush's outfit um, when we finished yep. the live. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I have to be honest, the pants and the top are from the same designer in Sydney, Australia. Um, and I think they're called Adler, A-D-L-E-R. Uh, they don't have a store. They sell exclusive, exclusively at the markets and I think in home things. I need to do a bit more research on them. The fit is amazing. Yeah. Uh, the fit of this shoe is amazing as well. Uh, you can see there lots of flexibility. I'm getting a lovely slimline look in through that toe there. Um, but without that scrunchy feeling of feeling all like scrunched up. So yeah. Oh, exciting. Actually, a shout out to Little Red Fox. They did a beautiful picture of uh, one of their customers or themselves styled in them. And how they styled them was with a very slim leather look pant uh, and this pop of drama at the bottom, like they were black leather look trousers or something. It looked amazing. So, so equally, I've got the wide leg pant on and it's working extremely well. But with a very nice, if you've got a nice slim leg and you've got those slim pants on that leather look, it looks insanely good. Uh, it's only hot. Um, so yeah, we we sometimes affectionately call these the 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 weather ladies shoe. Mm. You know the newsreader mm. weather mm. ladies shoes because it's that sophisticated style. Uh, so that is style, Andy. I'm just going back to another boot. Ayla yes. wants to know where the Piper boots sit on the leg. Uh, the Piper boots sit on the leg um, just under your 
we had a chat about this it's sort of like mid to lower calf muscle mm -hmm. so if i look if you want to look at my yanny leg um it's going to go to about it's going to go to about here on my leg everyone has different measurements and through this here but but it's going to hit about there um perfect height i'm going to say if you're a good trouser wearer mm -hmm. and you want to sit down and your trouser pops up you've got that full coverage of your leg underneath the trouser uh equally um they ha they are a nice height for under a, a maxi skirt um but if you've got that mid height uh, mid height long skirt um I guess mid calf height long skirt. It's going to look a little mm. bit sandwichy. We do have other boots that are definitely higher up the leg if you're wanting that full look up mm -hmm. the leg. Yeah. What's over here? Oh, look what's over here. What's going on over here? So let me share you share this with you. This here is style Dutchy uh, for obvious reasons. A little Dutch cloggy look to it. So you've got this lovely um, crepe looking rubber outsole, platform sole. This is divinely comfortable, the sole unit. It just feels like you're wearing little sponges on your feet. It gives you elevation. So for people like Ella and myself, uh, we like that height. It's definitely giving you a little bit of elevation with all the comfort. So let's take a look at her. Um, we've talked about the sole. Let's talk about the toe shape. So we've got a nice squared off toe on this. You've got that lovely matte finished chain detail um, tab in through the front here. Uh, she is luxely lined with uh, the Sherpa style shearling um, lining in here. It's a microfiber, it's, um, it's antibacterial, so it's designed to absorb perspiration in the foot and things like that. It has like a little inserted wedge here of elastic so we get that fit over your arches. Um, I could actually slip that on. I'll show you the other colorway as well. Uh, so the other colorway here is the khaki. Mm -hmm. uh, which is very statement. So you've got that lovely caramel gum colored uh, crepe looking outsole in here, which of course is just rubber. Uh, and then you've got the lovely khaki leather, uh, that black matte trim on there again. And then it's lined with that super sherpa kind of um, soft lining. I can put it on with my pants actually, because it's probably quite a good one um, to wear with. Um... Oh, look at that. So these are, these are, jump in and go ones so it, that's with like a wide leg pant um equally if you've got like a little i can imagine these with like a maxi floral dress or um some little <clears throat> denim shorts still in, in summer if you're burning around um yeah but it's oh it's just it's so comfy and soft and squidgy it's delicious so these are out now and these are a good shoe for right now ladies mm -hmm. dutchy dutchy yeah. i love the height that they give you mm. so so good so, so good. Right, uh, I feel like we might be boring you now, and we've got lots and lots more styles to show you. We need so, to get them why don't we? Yeah, we need to get these ones online, and um, we'll show you. We'll pick up tomorrow and show you some uh, more new stylings that have come into the back here. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Have we got any more questions before we go? No. No. Thank you, ladies. For thank watching. you so much for your time. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Stay dry and um, don't go out in the wind. Okay. Bye. bye.